in industries we are facing several problems and issues that challenges safety production and cost for a particular problem there could be many solutions but only a few would be viable depending upon the prevailing site condition today we have many solutions and alternatives for those earlier problems for instance product or steam leaks were nightmare for operation and maintenance departments but gone are those days where we were to shut down the whole plant fully or partly until the full proof solutions like online hot sealing have come in effectively like this there are many advanced new tools new materials new methods keep coming to help us still a new day some new challenges are waiting i have toiled over 40 years in several industries and have many stories to share with you also i have many colleagues to add their own stories and solutions in this channel i like to share our experience of several industrial problems that were faced and successful solutions which gave great relief it's worthwhile to share the valuable experience that we all faced in dealing with such challenges our experience might be useful to you you may apply them as such if applicable or modify it to suit to your requirement in this episode we are going to discuss of the persistent problem of vertically suspended submergible pumps despite of many advantages most of such pumps suffer of frequent suction strain and choking barring some clean applications most of them are used for pumping dirty water with a lot of suspended debris from the sumps hence they get plugged at the suction strainers quite often cleaning the suction strainer have always been painful problem most of such pumps are situated all around the pump let's list out the issues in attending the cleaning job of such suction strainers vertically suspended pump normally needs crane to lift to access its suction strainer mobilizing crane for this purpose is cost and time consuming effort and like other pumps vs pumps requires more manpower to do this simple job suction strainer cleaning to elaborate this point besides the main technicians crane operators and the electricians are additionally required the discharge line flanges are to be unbolted to facilitate the pump lifting and must be fixed back after the pump is dropped to its position the horizontal pumps strainers can be attended without disturbing the pumps same way what need to be done for vertical pumps such that the strainers can be cleaned without disturbing the pumps following modifications gives a way out pump suction is extended as shown and the strainer is rested upside down whenever the strainer cleaning work is warranted 
The strainer can be simply lifted. Cleaning work is to be performed. Then lowering down to its position completes the job. The strainer is designed to sit on the respective flange without any bolting. The strainer flanges are preferably conical as to ensure concentric positioning. The tie rod gaze and ensures the proper positioning of the strainer on to its location. Lifting and lowering can simply be done by a chain block or pulled by a utility truck. No need for cranes anymore. When cleaning is in process, to ensure safety, the strainer access hole is to be temporarily covered by suitable board. Despite of this precaution, if anything slips into the sum and into the suction port, they are expected to get trapped at the bottom of the tea branch. Additionally, a conical strainer can also be included at the suction flange. This should prevent any debris that manages to get into the suction line during the strainer cleaning process. This modification calls for one-time alteration works at the site. Pumps suction system must be modified to facilitate strainer's new position. This calls for additional pipe works with couple of pipe bends. Pumps access hole and the base frame ought to be modified to accept new setup. But for the first installation, there should not be a need for crane mobilization forever. This is one single big saving of cost and time. After this modification, strainer cleaning work should require lesser manpower than earlier. MTTR mean time to repair is expected to be grossly reduced.